That's fine. Now, you were calling that a peanut cover, right? That's what that is, a peanut cover. Uh, so, um, because hold it up and do what you did yesterday. What Re do you mean? Remember? Uh, you were trying to get me to understand why it was called a peanut cover. Why it was called a peanut cover? Yeah, and um, show me about how what you said about it being called a peanut cover. Because it's shaped like a peanut. Like Mr. Peanut. Yeah, see. So did you write that upside down then? Um, I don't know, did I? I was just practicing like I said. Uh, yeah, you called that a peanut cover because it's shaped like Mr. Peanut. I know it doesn't match, but I'm just playing with it right now. When you first told me about a peanut cover, I'm like, what in the world? A peanut. So you see how it's shaped like a peanut? Like Mr. Peanut. Well, I could actually make a Mr. Peanut out of it. You could. And kind of put some glasses on it with an eye. That would be funny. Wouldn't that be funny? Yep. But I had to practice with my brushes to find out which ones were I could use and which ones I can't. What they would do. So, like I said, I got 50 brand new brushes. And so, anyway, so I was just playing around with it. I did put cat and I sprayed over it. I could spray over that. When it I bet you'd be the only person that has a Mr. Peanut themed peanut cover. You can't cover. really see this anyway because here's going to be the fan. The fan. You got the fan motor. You got that big old right there, Horton, right here. Then you got the fan. Then you have the fan shroud. So the only way you can look at it is if you stand right here and stick your head in there. And look. <laughs> Nobody's even going to see it. But yeah, but you would know about it. You would know that Mr. Peanut's there. So if you want something on there to be seen, you'll have to write it down the side here. Because oh. you can see the side of it. 